welcome to a new edition of the Everlast Power video series. In today's edition, we're going to take a look at the all-new PowerEye MiG 140E. This MiG welder is in keeping with our tradition of providing economical inverter-based welders and plasma cutters. This new PowerEye MiG has an affordable price of $399 and provides optimum performance as an 120 volt MiG. The PowerEye MiG 140E has an output range of 25 to 140 amps. This is similar to what you'd find on the market with other MiGs in its class. You may be asking what is special about this unit? What is different to set it apart from dozens of its competitors? The simple answer to that is that it's an inverter. This means that it weighs less than half the weight compared to well-known transformer MiGs in its category. It will also reduce power input demands. The real difference shows up in the duty cycle comparisons. Traditional 120 volt transformer MiGs usually are rated about 20% duty cycle at 90 amps. That's not a lot, but the iMig 140E is rated 25% duty cycle at 140 amps. Now this is enough to be a serious contender for anyone needing maximum portability and convenience. Now let's take a few minutes to take a look at some of the other features and setup of the unit. Design of the unit is straightforward. It comes pre-wired with a standard NEMA 515 plug for 120 volt operation. There is a clear protective cover over the controls which shields the area from accidental damage. Both amp and voltage controls are infinitely adjustable within the range, allowing you to precisely tune the voltage for the job. Unlike most transformer makes, there are no stepped A, B, C, or D settings for voltage. To the left, the unit features warning lights for duty cycle and overcurrent. On the right, you'll find the switch for the spool gun. And on the far left, the on indicator, which will remain on while the unit is powered up. On the bottom, you'll find the Euro style quick connect, which is compatible with several other brands of welders. This will allow you to easily add any gun option you wish, and connecting the gun takes mere seconds and no tools. Just above the gun connection is the 25 series dense connector for the work clamp. And on top of the stack is the control connection for the spool gun. Please note on this unit that the spool gun also uses the Euro connection for the power and gas supply to the gun. As you can see, the unit is compact in size. The dimensions are 17 and a half inches long by 13 and a half inches high and barely eight and a half inches wide. It weighs in at about 25 pounds. The largest spool of wire this unit will support is 8 inches in diameter. This is good enough for up to 10 to 12 pound spools if you're using solid steel wire. Of course, the spool carrier will also accommodate 4 inch spools which are the size used with spool guns. The heavy duty wire feed mechanism is made from cast aluminum and steel. It will support feeding of wire diameters from .023 to .035 with the stock drive roll. However, for best results, .023 to .030 wire is recommended for best operation. Additional flux core drive rolls may be used and are optional. These are directly available from Everlast. The rear of the unit is set up as simple as the front. The power switch is located conveniently at the top, and the gas connection is located directly below that. Of course, the fan is located in the back as well. Make sure that you have at least 12 inches clearance at the back so proper cooling can be maintained. This concludes our overview of the Everlast PowerEye MiG 140E. Please join us for the next Power Video Edition when we'll take a more detailed look at the accessories and setup of the Everlast PowerEye MiG 140E. As always, if you have more questions about the product presented, call us at 877-755-9353. And if you haven't yet, we welcome you to come visit our new website at www.everlastwelders.com.